Hello, this is Young Meek here, to, back with another video. Today, I'm going to be playing Strategy and Tactics World War II, and we're going to be doing the campaign today. So, let me see, beginning, oops, wrong, wrong one, wrong one. Gotta go back. But yeah, we're going to be looking at the birth of tragedy, the beginning of the war. So we're going to be looking at the the war from the Germans' perspective uh, from 1939 to 1941. Okay, that isn't too bad. Operation Vice. Main Jetta conquer all the uh, con uh, conquered the province of Warsaw. Defeat five divisions. Defeat condition. Fail to take provinces. Okay. Hmm. We got a lot of divisions here. But honestly, I think we should be fine. Mostly uh, infantry divisions. I don't see too many of tanks, so. Yeah, hopefully. So we're going to attack here. We're going to decline that one, actually. Uh, so then wh whenever the troops retreat, they retreat into that province. We're going to attack with two divisions here, leaving one behind, and attack with, uh, say, one division here. Okay, let's begin. Yep, just planned. All right. I am speaking to you from the cabinet room at 10 Downing Street. This morning, the British ambassador in Berlin handed the German government a final note stating that unless we heard from them by 11 o'clock, that they were prepared at once to withdraw their troops from Poland, a state of war would exist between us. I have to tell you now that no such undertaking has been received and that consequently this country is at war with Germany. Sorry for my silence there. Just heard from uh, Naval Chamberlain that uh, they finally declared war on us. That's crazy. <laughs> it, was totally, it was totally the Polish fault. Totally. All right, so move my last remaining division over here. Uh, and I think some paratroopers will be enough just to take up. A, yeah, I don't really have that many resources. So we'll attack with uh, these full divisions, these full nine divisions. Gonna attack with these full six divisions and have two divisions as support victory all right so that was pretty short not gonna lie so uh let's move on to the next the next one oh our name is a uh august and that looks like field marshal um field marshal mortal mortal myrtle myrtle mortal Modo? Modo. <laughs> anyway. It seems it appears that they're speaking in English. Oh my gosh. So I think I'll let them uh, do their talking. If you guys want to pause and read it. Uh, but I think it's giving enough time just to read it. But. Just letting, just letting them go by.
Also, if you, uh, for anybody that doesn't really study World War II or has been living under a rock for basically forever, uh, so the battle, the invasion of Poland actually lasted a little longer than now. What was entailed in the video, uh, it lasted from like, it lasted from September 1st. 1939 to like I think uh, October like the midway of October like that's just how stubborn this resistance was between uh, Germany and Poland and then afterwards uh, the Soviet Union came in and note that the Soviet Union wasn't actually in in a alliance with uh, Germany but we're just in a pact that stated hey we gonna get these territory and we're gonna uh, you're gonna get this territory so it looks like we're vain Denmark and Norway this time around with the uh, 15 turns for gold all right so this should be a fairly easy one we got uh, more more rise divisions and so in this game for those who don't know motorized divisions actually can do two uh, make two moves so the uh, first one is kind of like the your first move your halfway point and then the second one uh, more because like motorized can like go greater distance that's why they're able to uh, do two moves essentially. So we're gonna attack with this one motorized, um, only because I believe that the troops will be destroyed with the Air Force. Yeah. Don't need to worry about that. And, oh man. Attacking one motorized division with two infantry divisions. Hope oh, my mains is okay. <clears throat> so we're gonna. Uh, Move you well. Okay. Damage you with the Air Force. Now, I doubt they're gonna attack me. Yeah. They're getting infantry reinforcements. Oh man. So I kinda wish I had the Air Force uh, airborne right now. So we're gonna bring up the Air Force real quick. Um, I want to be able to do damage to whatever troops are on the front lines. So they brought more troops to the front line. I don't know, they they brought less. Or like they took away some divisions. So we're gonna send five divisions over there, not including the um <laughs> not including the uh um, motorized division. Of course, because I'm gonna need these uh, motorized divisions just to cut through places. So then I'm gonna send these two up, um, yeah, up north, like northwest. Yeah. Okay, so they attacked at that province. I have no idea why they would do that. Just killed a bunch of their own men. But maybe the uh, fortress will actually help them. And in that case, then it's a big risk. Right, we're gonna attack with that. Mora is coming in clutch right now. <laughs> Okay, so we attack the infantry. Uh, I don't appear to have any divisions that can take out the one just for the division that attack. So we'll just attack ahead. And we've gotten closer now, so we're gonna dare drop some troops over there. And I think I need to bring my air force closer. So what we'll do, we'll probably just push that division back. 
we hope that we can uh, get them away from our Air Force. As our Air Force is very important in this game. Okay, so they decide to attack uh, frontally. We'll bring the uh, elite troops. And I think while we're gathering our troops, we will just bombard them. So they move right there. Where are you going? Okay, well, let's try bringing these uh, divisions closer. And actually, I want to unite the uh, divisions together. So let's move our Air Force because he's getting a little too close. Danger close there. Move you right there. Oh, and now they're going back to Denmark. Okay. To think that the AI would make this simpler for me. Uh, I think moving my Air Force back there would be fine. And I'll just take back Oslo real quick. And they just keep going down now. Uh, yeah, we'll send the entire force. <clears throat> it's not like uh, we're gonna be able to do anything. Man, I think I'm gonna wait and uh, wait to purchase some units. Okay, so I believe I'm in a position right now that we can take him. Wait, let's wait. Okay, so now they've cornered themselves in Copenhagen. This is great. This be a easy kill. Uh, and I think I'll use the uh, paratroopers now. So bring all our forces together just to make this one attack. Easy destruction. Take that and. What? Ah, come on, you can't be serious. <laughs> come, all right, sure. Okay, so you went over there. Uh, you take that, send one division over here to take that. Air Force bombards here, and then we bring the rest of our forces to take that. Alright, so that was a fairly easy uh, campaign. <clears throat> if you guys want more, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.